It's a battle for early position in the A-10 West as Xavier visits Duquesne. The Muskies look to win two in a row and get to 500 in the league, led by last season's A-10 Rookie of the Year, Tara Booth. The sophomore leads Xavier in scoring and in rebounds. At the same time, Duquesne has its own scoring threat in Candace Boutrell as the Dukes look to go 3-1 and one in the A-10. We tip off the A-10 television schedule with Xavier and Duquesne next. schedule on the A-10 television network. These two teams contrasting in styles while Duquesne has senior leadership, Xavier has to depend on its underclassmen. Well, Xavier lost the likes of a dynamic duo in the backcourt, Amy Wall and Retta Papari, so they're relying on newcomers and sophomores to lead the squad, whereas Duquesne is relying on a senior experience backcourt. Let's talk about one of those sophomores that Xavier is depending on, super sophomore Tara Booth. Well, Tara Booth is just such a tremendous natural basketball player. She plays with such ease and such strong, diverse moves inside. She is leading her team in scoring. Tara Booth has had nine 20-point games this season. Last year, she was the Atlantic 10 Rookie of the Year. Right now, Tara Booth is tied for third in scoring in the Atlantic 10. First in scoring in the Atlantic 10? It's that person, Candace Futrell. Candace Futrell, the senior leading the Duquesne Dukes, is so tremendous and impactful in the open court. She has the ability to have great court vision, see her open players, but perhaps what I like best about her game is her ability to drive and penetrate and get to the hole. She ranks six on the Dukes' all-time leading scorer, and she's also leading the A-10 in scoring. Should be a great battle today. Other players to watch, Sunny Granderson from Xavier. She shoots three-pointers without a conscience. Also for Duquesne, Sherry Sharon. She just set a new school record for assists. It's Xavier and Duquesne coming up next on the A-10 Basketball Network. 